between the final two flights in the www.fairyhouse.ie hurdle. And it's the odds on favourite, Honeysuckle, coming away from Easy Game. And at the final flight, Honeysuckle over from Easy Game, well clear from Mr. Blue Sky. And into the closing stages, Honeysuckle will extend her winning sequence in her comeback race of the season and has won going away from Stable Companions, Easy Game and Mr. Blue Sky. Between the final two flights and the www.fairyhouse.ie hurdle and it's the odds on favourite, Honeysuckle, coming away from Easy Game. And at the final flight, Honeysuckle over from Easy Game, well clear from Mr. Blue Sky. And into the closing stages, Honeysuckle will extend her winning sequence in her comeback race of the season and has won going away from Stable Companions, Easy Game and Mr. Blue Sky. with the race now at Cerberus's mercy. The danger in front and behind as Cerberus and JJ Slevin come to jump the last, and they're over clear from Red Jerry, Guinevere, Instant Return, Gallic, Recent Revelation, Severus Alexander, Midnight, Geisha, Cerberus, JJ Slevin have won by a wide margin, getting off the mark in fine style over hurdles. Second, Red Jerry, third is Guinevere, and fourth, Instant Return. Number with the race now at Cerberus's mercy. The danger in front and behind as Cerberus and JJ Slevin come to jump the last, and they're over clear from Red Jerry, Guinevere, Instant Return, Gallic, Recent Revelation, Severus Alexander, Midnight, Geisha, Cerberus, JJ Slevin have won by a wide margin, getting off the mark in fine style over hurdles. Second, Red Jerry, third is Guinevere, and fourth, Instant Return. Number It is Deal Kerr from Escaria 10 on the outside of Monkfish as they come down towards the last. And it is Deal Kerr from Monkfish who's trying to rally again on the far side of Escaria 10 over the last. It's Deal Kerr from Monkfish in third place is Escaria 10 and up to the finish. Deal Kerr and Sean Flanagan will win after an absence from Monkfish. And in third place, Escaria 10. And with a faller at the final flight, it was Epson de O. It is Deal Kerr from Escaria 10 on the outside of Monkfish as they come down towards the last. And it is Deal Kerr from Monkfish who's trying to rally again on the far side of Escaria 10 over the last. It's Deal Kerr from Monkfish in third place is Escaria 10 and up to the finish. Deal Kerr and Sean Flanagan will win after an absence from Monkfish, and in third place, Escaria 10, and with a faller at the final flight, it was Epson de O. Right back at you and Lagenard on the outside as they come down towards the last. Right back at you and Lagenard. Lagenard is coming right back at you as they come down to the final flight. And it's Lagenard over the last with ears pricked from right back at you. They're clear from Theophilus Magic. See, I know what I am now. Bally Madon, William of Wiccan. But it's Lagenard and Philip Enright who win cosily from right back at you. Theophilus Magic, see, William of Wickham. I know what I am now. Right back at you and Lagenard on the outside as they come down towards the last. Right back at you and Lagenard. Lagenard is coming right back at you as they come down to the final flight. And it's Lagenard over the last with ears pricked from right back at you. They're clear from Theophilus Magic. See, I know what I am now. Bally Madon, William of Wiccan. But it's Lagenard and Philip Enright who win cosily from right back at you. Theophilus Magic C. William of Wickham, I know what I am now.
racing for the final flight. And it is Elegant Lass from on the outside, Johnny Sue. Then Dawson's Cottage, Mighty Jeremy is next with Solar Heat staying on again. Johnny Sue will lead the final flight. Has caught it the long time leader, Elegant Lass. Solar Heat is in between horses with a late burst. Mighty Jeremy on the near side. And Solar Heat is driven on to win for Mark Enright and Dennis Hogan with second. Second is close, Mighty Jeremy and Lovely Cottage. And then Johnny Sue, Elegant Lass, Dawson's Cottage racing for the final flight and it is elegant lass from on the outside johnny sue then dawson's cottage mighty jeremy is next with solar heat staying on again johnny sue will lead the final flight has collared the long time leader elegant lass solar heat is in between horses with a late burst mighty jeremy on the near side and solar heat is driven on to win for mark enright and dennis hogan with second second is close mighty jeremy and lovely cottage and then johnny sue elegant lass dawson's cottage Courage. And then comes Galvin and Ronald Palm has come now to head by Palm as they come down to the final fence and by Palm is losing second to Galvin then speak easy Castleborn West runs on but it's Ronald Pump over the last and gone clear from Galvin second then speak easy Captain CJ Castleborn West and dropping out quickly is the long time leader by Palm but it is Ronald Pump and uh, Adam Short scooting clear to win this beginners in great style from Captain CJ Speakeasy Galvin and Castleborn West next. And then comes Galvin and Ronald Palm has come now to head by Palm as they come down to the final fence. And by Palm is losing second to Galvin, then Speakeasy. Castleborn West runs on, but it's Ronald Pump over the last and gone clear from Galvin second, then Speakeasy. Captain CJ Castleborn West and dropping out quickly is the long time leader by Palm, but it is Ronald Pump and uh, Adam Short scooting clear to win this beginners in great style from Captain CJ Speak, Easy Galvin and Castleborn West. Next. Then ask Corey, but steer clear over on the far side is coming there strongly to pick it up from Enduring Love and all duck or no dinner knocked back to third and then cave two and at the final fence steer clear. That's an awkward enough jump and over on the far side Enduring Love and Joanna Walton have taken full advantage with steer clear on the near side fighting back. 50 yards to go and the lady supporting Susan Handicap Chase and it is Enduring Love who's just held the renewed late effort of steer clear after getting the last all wrong then cave to ask Corey then ask Corey but steer clear over on the far side is coming there strongly to pick it up from enduring love and all duck or no dinner knocked back to third and then cave two and at the final fence steer clear that's an awkward enough jump and over on the far side enduring love and Joanna Walton have taken full advantage with steer clear on the near side fighting back 50 yards to go and the lady supporting Susan Handicap Chase and it is enduring love who's just held the renewed late effort of steer clear after getting the last all wrong then cave to ask Corey. It's a 1-2 for Gordon Elliott as we speak. On the far side is from Eden. On the near side is Diamond Turf. Then we've got a length to spare over Glamorgan. Duke Cherokee Bill is starting to stay on, as is the White Volcano. As they come to the last, it's from Eden and Davy Russell. Lands just in front, but he's pecked on landing. Diamond Turf's on the outside, trying to close the gap. Then we've got Glamorgan Duke, but from the clouds, we've got the White Volcano. It's from Eden on the far side. Diamond Turf on the near side. The White Volcano is closing the gap all the time. It's from Eden and Diamond turf the white volcano is trying to get there all the time but for me has just done enough for Davy Russell from a staying on the white volcano in third was diamond turf and it's a double to seal the card for trainer Gordon Elliott it's a 1-2 for Gordon Elliott as we speak. On the far side is from Eden. On the near side is 
diamond turf. Then we've got a length of spare over Glamorgan. Duke Cherokee Bill is starting to stay on, as is the White Volcano as they come to the last. It's from Eden and Davy Russell. Lands just in front, but he's pecked on landing. Diamond turf's on the outside, trying to close the gap. Then we've got Glamorgan Duke, but from the clouds, we've got the White Volcano. It's from Eden on the far side. Diamond turf on the near side. The White Volcano is closing the gap all the time. It's from Eden and Diamond turf. The White Volcano is trying to get there all the time, but from Eden has just done enough for Davy Russell from a staying on the White Volcano. In third was Diamond Turf, and it's a double to seal the card for trainer Gordon Elliott.